Hi, my name is Megan Bergstrom, and I will be teaching um, in USD 269, which is a combination of three small towns, uh, Damar, Palco, and Zurich. I will be teaching agriculture at Palco Junior Senior High School, which is located in Palco. I will have one eighth grade ag exploration class, and the rest will be high school classes. Um, the only extracurricular responsibility I will have within the school, as of right now, is FFA. Um, there's a lot of support in the community for FFA, which I think will be a big asset to me as I take over the program. Um, I graduated from Fort Hayes last May with a degree in animal science. I spent a few months working at a large-scale commercial hog farm by Osborne, Kansas, and then went to work for Midland Marketing part-time here in Palco. Um, I had been struggling with what career I wanted to pursue, and I was at the college talking to some previous pro professors um, when one of them mentioned this transition to teach program and that there was a need for agriculture teachers in the state of Kansas. Um, I have a strong passion for agriculture and I want to be able to teach kids about this industry and hopefully get them interested in it as well. Um, I have a serious boyfriend that lives here in Palco and throughout my time at the co-op here I've been able to meet a lot of farmers and families in the area so I'm really I was really excited to find out that there was an opening for an ag teacher in this district. Um, <clears throat> Some of the critical factors that I found on the KSE website were um, the percentage of economically disadvantaged students and the percentage of students with disabilities. 64.3% um, of the high school students are economically disadvantaged compared to the state average of 48.07%, which isn't necessarily surprising to me since it's such a small community. Um, I could maybe see this causing some problems in the, in the classroom. Um, the other thing that I looked at was the percentage of students with disabilities is a little higher than average for the state. Um, in the high school, 25% of the students um, have disabilities compared to the state average of 14.74%. Um, I could see this being a little bit of a problem just because of the fact that I'm so inexperienced with teaching um, and I'm, I, I don't know quite how to accommodate for the disabilities, which I'm hoping is something I'll pick up and learn in, my, in our classes. Um, one of the other things about the school is the small size. Enrollment for the high school was 28 students, um, and from speaking to the teachers in the districts, most kids are involved in a lot, if not every, extracurricular activity. Um, this sounds awesome, and I'm glad the students are really involved. I also uh, worry about if the kids will get burnt out or not, or be able to um, focus on their classes. So, thank you.